Tetrafluoroborylate or orthofluoroborylate beryllium fluoride 4 is an anion containing beryllium and fluorine. The ion has a tetrahedral shape, the same size and outer electron structure as sulfate. Therefore, many compounds that contain sulfate, have equivalents with tetrafluoroborylate. Examples of these are the langbinites, and Tutton's salts. Properties the VF distance is between 1.45 and 1.53 A, this bond is sp3 and has a longer length than the sp bond in beryllium fluoride gas. In trifluoroborylates, there are actually beryllium fluoride tetrahedra arranged in a triangle, so that three fluorine atoms are shared on two tetrahedra each, resulting in a formula of beryllium fluoride. In the tetrafluoroborylates, the tetrahedra can rotate to various degrees. At room temperatures, they are hindered from moving. But as temperature increases, they can rotate around the threefold axis, with a potential barrier of 12.5 kcal per mole. At higher temperatures, the movement can become isotropic with a potential barrier of 14.5 kcal per mole. Similar formula compounds have magnesium or zinc in a similar position. E.g. K2 magnesium fluoride or NH4 2 zinc fluoride, but these are not as stable. Tetrafluoroborylate has a biological effect by inhibiting F atpase ATP producing enzymes in mitochondria and bacteria. It does this by attempting to react with adenosine diphosphate because it resembles phosphate. However, once it does this, it remains stuck in the F1 part of the enzyme and inhibits it from further function. Simple salts Sodium tetrafluoroborylate has several crystalline forms. Below 220 degrees Celsius it takes the same form as orthorhombic olivine, and this is called gamma phase. Between 220 and 320 it is in the alpha form. When temperature is raised above 320 it changes to the hexagonal alpha form. When cooled the alpha Form changes to beta form at 110 degrees and this can be cooled to 70 degrees before changing back to the gamma form. It can be formed by melting sodium fluoride and beryllium fluoride. The gas above molten sodium tetrafluoroborylate contains beryllium fluoride and NaF gas. Lithium tetrafluoroborylate takes on the same crystal form as the mineral phenocyte. As a liquid it is proposed for the molten salt reactor, in which it is called flibby. The liquid salt has a high specific heat, similar to that of water. The molten salt has a very similar density to the solid. The solid has continuous void channels through it, which reduces its density. Li-2 beryllium fluoride can be crystallized from aqueous solution using NH4 2 beryllium fluoride and lithium chloride. Potassium tetrafluoroborylate has the same structure as anhydrous potassium sulfate, as does rubidium and cesium tetrafluoroborylate. Potassium tetrafluoroborylate can make solid solutions with potassium sulfate. It can be used as a starting point to make the nonlinear optic crystal KBE2BO3F2 which has the highest power handling capacity and shortest UV performance of any borate. It is quite soluble in water, so beryllium can be extracted from soil this in this form. Ammonium tetrafluoroborylate decomposes on heating by losing NH4F vapor, progressively forming NH4 beryllium fluoride, then NH4 beryllium fluoride, and finally beryllium fluoride. Thallium tetrafluoroborylate can be made by dissolving beryllium fluoride and thallium carbonate together in hydrofluoric acid and then evaporating the solution. Radium tetrafluoroborylate is used as a standard neutron source. The alpha particles from the radium cause neutrons to be emitted from the beryllium. It is precipitated from a radium chloride solution mixed with potassium tetrafluoroborylate. Magnesium tetrafluoroborylate can be precipitated from a hot saturated solution of ammonium tetrafluoroborylate and a magnesium salt. However, if the temperature reaches boiling point magnesium fluoride is precipitated instead. Calcium tetrafluoroborylate resembles zircon in the way it melts and crystallizes. Strontium tetrafluoroborylate can be made in several forms. The Y is produced by cooling a melt of SRF2 and B2, and the beta from is made by precipitating from a water solution. When melted and heated to 850 to 1145 degrees, B2 gas evaporates, leaving behind molten SRF2. The barium tetrafluoroborylate is very insoluble and can be used for gravimetric analysis of beryllium. H2 beryllium fluoride is an acid that can be produced from Ag2 beryllium fluoride and HCl. 
It only exists dissolved in water. Triglycine tetrafluoroborylate (TGFB) is ferroelectric with a transition point of 70 degrees Celsius. The crystals can be formed by dissolving beryllium fluoride in water, adding HF and then glycine. When the solution is cooled, triglycine tetrafluoroborylate forms. Cs2 beryllium fluoride and Tl2 beryllium fluoride in the solution reduce growth on the OO1 direction so that tabular shaped crystals of TGFB form. The thallium compound can cut growth on the OO1 axis by 99%. Double salts The Tutton salt NH4 2 Minnesota beryllium fluoride 2.6 H2O is made from a solution of NH4 beryllium fluoride mixed with NH4 manganese 3 fluoride. The equivalent of alums are hard to make because the trivalent ion will often form a complex with fluoride in preference to the beryllium fluoride. However the violet-colored acid and rubidium chrome alum exist at chilly temperatures for a few hours. Tutton salts containing magnesium with fluoroborylate are difficult to produce, as the solutions tend to precipitate insoluble magnesium fluoride. References <laughs>